Hey everyone, welcome back to Compiler Squad. My name is Meher Vyas and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to create a custom side menu bar like this. So in this screen, you can see we have a navigation button and when I click on this button, the UI view will appear. So this is our side menu bar. So let's see how it works. So in our Xcode, I already did create a view controller and embedded a navigation controller in it. So we have our navigation bar here and now we add a bar button item okay and I also select an image for this so I have an image for the side menu bar and now again we create a UI view for our side bar. So set the constraint for top 0, leading 0 and bottom 0 and also select the width by 240 or whatever you want okay and then give it to a background color okay. all right so we have our ui view we have our navigation item so now we write a program to animate this Okay, so now we connect our outlets and the actions. Create an action for side menu and for animation we also set the outlet of leading constraint. okay and now one more thing for hide this ui view we set the x-axis for minus 240 and set the constraints okay so in our view controller first we create a variable as a boolean value like variable minus side menu equals to okay so inside menu we create a condition like if my side menu is false then leading constant the constant equals to minus 240 else leading constant dot constant equals to zero okay and here my side menu equals to not going my side menu so this three lines of code animate the ui view for the side menu bar so let's run our code and see how it's work so we have our side menu but for the animation we sell we set the ui view animation so ui view dot animate so for time interval 0.3 second and for delay 0.1 and we don't want a spring with dimensions we don't want this for option we set the curves even and for animation we set the self self dot view dot layout if needed and this program just copy and paste for the else condition now let's run our program and see okay so you can see that we set our delay pattern and with duration so this sidebar comes with the animation 
so for more customization you can also add some ui buttons on it so just go to the view controller and first select your view and just give it the zero i zero x axis and then you can set the ui buttons here By this you can also add some UI buttons and the other animations. So this is a simple tutorial.